Hello guys, so many of you might get stuck to this screen trying to install your Windows uh, telling you that you have no hard drives for your files that means you have to manually provide these files so that Windows can install the drivers and go forward to the installation process uh, what you have to do is have a second PC with an internet connection now uh, many of you might search your uh, provider, your uh, manufacturer page in my case the new laptop is a Rockstrix Car 15 I'm on Asus uh, webpage, but on the driver page I, I find no storage device driver. That means I have to manually search it on the Intel website, but to be short I have provided the link below in my description. So you can download the archive and then I'm going to, I'm going to uh, show you what to do next. So this is the archive with the driver. I copied it to my flash drive. I'm going to extract all. I'm going to search uh, to select the path directly on the root. In my case, is D. So now the files are extracted over here, and uh, now you have to reset your um, installment process. Now I'm going to reset without. Uh, entering my USB stick because I want to make a setting in the BIOS that will also help you. So what I'm going to do is go to advanced mode, then advanced, go below to VMD setup. Now for some of you might work uh, just going forward with the installment after you um, put your uh, flash drive inside your laptop but some of you might not so it's best to disable the VMD controller okay now I'm going to save but before this I'm going to insert my bootable disk okay now we are going forward to the installment process and uh, it should find the drivers on my USB drive. Okay. Okay. English install. Windows. <clears throat> accept next custom so as you can see it directly found my uh, drive now you can format your drive you can make partitions you can go forward with the installation process so i hope this helped guys thank you very much and have a good day bye bye